my love's room lady girl from runaway we have culture conversation and community in today's video i'm coming to you all with a baddies wrong wrong with a south central baddies okay um this show is airing on now that's tv um it's an app i always want to say it's on site because the logos literally look the same but you can download it and watch it y'all i'm not gonna lie i was like should i review this show should i not like the red to reality tv like does it does something to me a little bit but i figured that i would since um the girl special k is a uh, executive producer on there and y'all know if y'all been rocking with me for a minute listen I started watching, um, reviewing One More Chance or whatever the case. And Special K was one of the first girls, like after the reunion had aired and it was what it was. I had reached out to Special K and, and, and I was reached out to her to get like an interview or whatever the case. And I, I could tell it was her and she was just like, oh, I have to have my team reach out to you. Like, girl, please. Um, she played me nonetheless. <laughs> She probably got, you know, because I gave her all my information, like, oh, you know, my, you know, yang, 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 yang. And she probably looked that shit up. I was like, I wish I would come on your platform. I'm mad at her. But I'm like, you know what? Since Special K, she was like the one we love to hate the most. Let's see how she's giving it up. And baby, let's get into it. Special K is bringing all the girls in the house. Um, you know, the intro song is eh. Um, one thing about Big Lex is she had her own music, so she kind of knew what the vibe that she wanted to go for, and this was eh, again. Um, girls are sitting in the living room, <laughs> and she's like, you know, are y'all ready? Are y'all excited? Cause my, because my season two, my season one girls brought it like how, Social K, you got shut down when you tried to reserve that Airbnb, and it was for five people, and you had 26 people in the house. Anyway, the girls are kind of looking like, they're like, hey, hey. It was not the same level of production uh, as Big Lex's show. It wasn't the same enthusiasm. Even like the level of badness, dare I say, was just a little different. So she has like this glass pen that she got out of somebody's mama's china cabinet. And she's like, you know, I want you to come up here and I want you to choose a name, whatever the number you choose, whatever name you choose or whatever is going to be who your room is. And I'm like, the directions is giving me very much gym class. Like one, two, three, one, two, three. And like when you're producing, you, you know who the characters are, who the players are, you know who is going to be who. Like I wouldn't have done it like that. So that's my initial reaction. Like, oh my gosh, here we go. So the girls were starting to just like introduce themselves, not even in the confessionals, literally just sitting around. I guess like they don't have the camera time. They don't have, they don't have the allotted time to just make it look like how the Zeus Network shows look because let's just face it, like that's what they're chasing. And let me just say Zeus Network shows like, you know, they yang 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 anyways. So <laughs> they're going around the room and I'ma just say who caught my attention. It was a couple people who started talking. The first person who caught my eye was Adora. She was beautiful. She's from Baltimore, Maryland DMV. I'm like, there are a lot of people from Baltimore that are like South Central LA type of thing. Cause isn't Krishan Rock from the DMV too? Like she from Baltimore? Like, what is it? Like a pipeline from Baltimore to LA? SoCal Barbie, she stood out to me. She's like, SoCal Barbie with three E's. I'm on all social media platforms. I'm like, okay. And they were having some hiccups with the confessionals. Um, the image was there. They did them, they did, they got themselves a nice little three point lighting setup. I know my lighting right now is trash and that's because baby, <laughs> listen, I'm barely, barely would have made it, okay? And sometimes I gotta be like that, but they're, lighting setup was nice but the sound the vocal hello hello can you hear me like girl i want them to get one of them little twitter them little mini twitter mics because at this point not twitter girl tiktok you know what i'm talking about that just sticks out um another girl leilani she stuck out to me she's from atlanta you know she's representing for the natural hair of the girls the sisters with locks okay then we have zoe girl zoe with the bad wig we have Zoe, she stands up and she got the body, yada, yada, yada. She's like, hey, how y'all doing? I'm 22, I'm from this. I'm like, okay, she might be about. So after they introduce, they, she comes up, they pull the names, they pull the numbers. However, I really don't even know how it was working. There was some sort of mix up. So Special K is like, you know what? 
y'all two, y'all didn't get numbers, y'all didn't get letters, y'all didn't get numbers, whatever it was. Okay, y'all two go home. So they just sitting there like, oh wow, like, okay, special K. And then the girl's like, oh, you know, you should let them give give them another chance. And I was like, damn, Zoe was one of the girls who I thought was gonna be cute. So I was feeling this type of way, like, you just wanna eliminate them like that. And then not to mention, like, y'all really pressed on, um, <laughs> not really pressed on it like that, but you know, they there for a reason. So the other girl said that they should stay and Special K is like, oh, it's okay, because it was a prank anyway. Like, Special K, that girl's still special. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say, because I, I thrashed her in my reviews, and I said I wasn't gonna do that. So I'm not gonna do that. But girl. They go to their rooms. The group the room one is a mess, girl. Just a hot mess. Like they didn't have enough room to house everybody. They had too many girls, if you ask me. Two is a mess, but out of the two, um, I guess like one of them didn't like one. Room three, uh SoCal Barbie was like, oh, I think our room is cute because we all got fat butts and we all like to throw it in a circle. I'm like, okay. Leilani takes an opportunity to say, shop her Poochie products, okay? She got Poochie pH balance products for you hoes and she ships globally. And I'm like, I don't pass judgment on people, or at least I try not to, but <laughs> okay. I mean, I don't know. I didn't look into her social media history or whatever. Maybe she does have a really successful business. Like, yeah, I got Yoni's themed pearls straight from Alibaba, straight to your home. I mean, I don't know. Maybe she does have a reputable business. If she does, shout out to her. Let me stop. I don't want to do that because this girl, it's hard to be out here making a business for yourself. And if she doing it, she doing it. But I just wouldn't want to buy my Yoni detoxes and bath <laughs> and Yoni baths and vaginal wall baths and cleanses from... Leilani off South Central Baddies. I'm just saying. Plug the product, girl. Plug the Poochie product. So Naja's in her room and she basically says, yeah, I, I'm not into, I don't like my roommate. And so the roommate turns out to be Kayla. Kayla starts talking. She's like this big, brolic, uh, Hispanic girl. And she's like, okay, so what don't you like? I don't understand. You don't even know me. And da 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 Naja uh, was like, I just don't like you. And then the girl, uh, what's her name? Kay? Kayla. Kayla was just like, oh, you just, it's not that you don't like me, you just can't take me, I'm a lot to take. So she stands up, so Naja, uh, Naja stands up, and then they start to get like, yang, 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 and Naja hooks up, boop, like she did like one of those flying off the rope type of boops, and got her in her eye good, y'all. When I tell you, when I say her eyes swelled up immediately, she must have got like thin blood or something, because baby her shit was like boom 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 like as soon as as soon as the the hit happened special k is trying to figure out what happened like you know and i was just explaining that there was some instagram groups group chat beef or whatever and they had beef before they got into the house Rynesha is going off because apparently she is friends with kayla and she felt like kayla um, Kayla was trying to make it seem like Rynesha was standing in her way. That's why she couldn't get fight. That's why she couldn't fight. But the girl snuck you, so doesn't matter. Rynesha's trying to get bugged. Because, no, I didn't do that. And when, when they reviewed the cameras, Rynesha was standing, like, in between them. And a girl came over her. And she feels like, oh, if she wasn't standing in my way, maybe I would have got to her. Who knows? By the way, that eye swelled up. Probably not. And the next thing we see Special K, um whispering something to goddess and um she does something weird to some shoes come and find out girl she puts hot cheetos in somebody's shoes which is like okay once barbie finds out that the girl put hot cheetos in her shoes is up and i mean like it's really up she takes all her uh shoes and puts them in a room she's like y'all not gonna be touching my stuff we're not doing that we're not playing those games and i can just tell by her movements and her mannerisms that mama is from the streets okay she might have been a street walker okay and she know how to handle stuff when you turn in tricks in the streets you'll slice it you feel what I'm saying? Goddess is on the other hand, just loving it. Yes, yes, I did it. Yes, yes, yes. She's just like really kind of loving the attention. Uh, but she not reading the room cause girl, it got real, real, real quick. Lindsay, who is another trans woman, um, was talking to her like, girl, you look a mess. You got loose skin and your thighs rubbed. Blah, 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 blah. They're just going in on Goddess. Goddess like, me, I look a mess. Do I look, do I look like I look a mess? Do you think I look a mess? Like, girl. So then we got into a whole, you know, who got who, who got what. 
Kenzie is like, you know me talking to production. You know me. What kind of car do I drive? I got a 2022 Maserati. And I'm like, oh my gosh. Imagine having a 2022 Maserati and still doing whatever you have to do for cloud to continue on with this money that you're getting to pay this probably super ridiculously high car note. But I digress. I mean, didn't Special K pull that whole I drive a Porsche bit too? <laughs> One more chance. Like, girl, no. Special K lets it be known. Like, if y'all got 5K to put into this house, by all means. But don't break nothing in this house. I don't care about nobody fighting nothing. But Special K, you the one who started it, sis. You are the one who started it. And I get it's your, it's your job to produce. But you got to know what you're doing. So the girls are kind of trying to relax. And um, E.T. says to Brown Sugar, like, Brown Sugar, well, what's up with you? You kind of quiet. Brown Sugar's like, yeah, man, listen, I've been shot before. You know, I had a major surgery, went through my spine. I don't got time for a whole bunch of yang yang talking. She got PTSD or something, you could tell. And E.T. and God is getting to this exchange where she's like, yeah, I understand. Like, I know E.T. was like, yeah, I know your type. You kind of quirky. And what she meant to say was quirky, but the girl said quirky, but you know, I digress. And, um, you know, <laughs> Urban Dictionary. We all knew what she meant. And she's like, no, I'm insane. I'm insane. I'm insane. I'm insane. And E.T.'s like, no, you're not insane, sis. <laughs> I can show you insane. You're not insane. So she was like, oh, so you want to fight? And then E.T. just gets up and just like, you know, goes at her. She's like, you know, all discombobulated trying to like get herself together but girl she ain't really know she first of all you're not insane you're trying to act like you putting on this character for the cameras but you got to realize it's some real life players in there and um now ain't the time to play super super bad tough guy when you're really not <laughs> with some real super bad tough guys like come on now and that was the end of the episode. Not for nothing, I think this is going to be a good little season, good little Ratchet TV. Let me know if you guys are interested in seeing more content like this before I like continue watching and nobody's here for it. I am a little bit interested. I want to see how it's going to play out. If y'all are not here for it, then, you know, I can do without. We're going to see how it goes. Um, let me know if you like this content. Like the video and subscribe. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm. That's all I got for today. As always, I'm sending you much love and much light. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.